What's up everybody, this is Armand. I uh, just wanted to give you guys a quick video. I've never done something like this so far, but I felt like I had to talk about it just a tiny bit. But um, a lot of people have been upset with the fact that King K. Rule was released on Smash 4 as just a costume for the Mii character. And uh, now, now I'm, I know he was a very, very heavily voted and uh, wanted character for the game, but, I mean, these people have slaved hours and hours to please you guys, and uh, just put characters you've wanted, and they've they've done so many things, especially Sakurai, because, uh, I mean, let's face it, he didn't even want to make Smash 4, he was tired of doing the same thing, he, he does not like repetition, you know, uh, I don't either. You know, things have to be different every now and then. But you guys, the fans, wanted it, and he supplied it. And because you wanted a character so badly, and... Now, no, it could have been just completely ignored. It could have been ignored to the fact... Like, to the point... It could have been ignored to the point where nothing could have been released involving King K. Rule. I mean, yeah, I mean... The me costume was released, and that's cool. Um, and I thought that was nice, but, like... I don't know why you guys have to, like, get so angry about this type of thing. Like, it's it's really not necessary. I mean, look at all the characters we have on the game specifically because the fans, you guys, wanted it. I'm not saying all of you Smash fans are like that. I mean, I'm not. But, like, it's just people really just need to grow up. I mean, do you know how hard it is to program things like that and get the textures, program it? design it, like, it's, it's not easy work, you know, and, I mean, Sakurai and all the developers and, uh, you know, people in charge of Smash 4 have done a lot for you fans, and, uh, I think what they did was enough, you know, I mean, I, I, King K. Rule was a popular character, heavily voted for, but, um, at the same time, I mean, you know, I mean, th just because that he was released as a me costume does not necessarily mean they don't plan to do anything else involving King K. Rule. I mean, this kind of just came out of the blue. Like, oh, I want King K. Rule on Smash. You think that's what people were thinking of when they first got Smash Four? Oh, this game would be awesome with King K. Rule. Like, the original Smash games didn't have DLC where you could get new characters. So what's the difference? I mean, it takes a lot to do what these people have done for, you know, Smash players and Smash fans and basically anybody that plays the game and wants the characters that they ask for. Um, yeah, I just felt like I had to touch on this a little bit. Um, might be doing more videos like this in the future, but I just wanted to say, I mean, fans, you guys need to be more grateful for what these people have done for you, you know? Um, even though, you know, it may not seem a lot to some of you guys, that's a lot of work doing what they've done. I mean, sure, Nintendo kind of screwed us over with the Amiibo crap and whatnot, but, um, I mean, still, that that's just Nintendo in general, the marketing people. Um, so that doesn't, that blame does not go strictly towards the, you know, game developers. Um, but, yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching, but I felt like I had to do this video. Uh, and if you liked it, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and I would appreciate that greatly. Uh, more content to come on the way. And have a good summer, everybody, and thank you for watching.